Hey miners, after the T-Rex 0.25.2 and 0.25.6 I've been mining Ethereum and Alithium. With this GPU 3070Ti, which is LHR, I'm getting great results and I'm satisfied. Everybody on the internet said to use the Ethereum LHR overclocks for dual, mi dual mining Ethereum and Alephium and in this video I want to show you the difference between my new overclocks and the old Ethereum overclocks I was using on this card. So for now my fans are at 80%, I have locked core clock on 975 and memory clock on 1450 for the old Ethereum LHR overclock settings. Let's see what results we are going to get with these settings. And here are the first results we are getting with these overclock settings that I was using before when I was only mining Ethereum on 74% LHR unlock with T-Rex. These are only the first results. Let's wait for second, third results and we are going to take one picture and put that results on what to mine and a lithium mining cal calculator. So around 55 megahash per second for Ethereum and 231 megahash per second on a lithium, sometimes 240. The power moves from 156 watts to 191 watts and board power draw is moving around the same ranges so we are going to take 185 watts for instance let's go on what to mine let's add 55 mega hash per second and 185 watts per hour click on calculate and here we are going to get only from Ethereum, one dollar and eighty-eight cents. One eighty-eight plus on a lithium, zero point two three five giga hash per second. The power consumption is already added on what to mine and click calculate the last 24 hours we would get 0 0.2119 USD 0 0.2119 that is around two dollars 2.1 2.1 dollars with the old overclock settings so now let's try the, my new overclock settings for dual mining Ethereum and the lithium that are with a locked core clock at 1650 and memory clock at 1450 like before. Let's start this bath file and try to get results and to get calculations. We got our first results here and on Ethereum we got again 55 megahash per second and on Alithium we got 80% um, more this time around 420 megahash per second this time board power draw says around 190 watts to 210 watts per hour so i'm going to take 
200 watts this time. Click calculate. And again on Ethereum we are getting 1.83. Dollars per day and plus on a lithium we're going to write 425 mega hash per second and on 24 hours we would get 0 0.38 USD Two point two dollars, and here are our results. And I think that the new overclock settings where core clock is higher than the old Ethereum LHR overclocks for thirty seventy Ti are better. Let me again show you my overclock settings. So the new overclock settings for my mining Ethereum and Alephium on my 3070 Ti are fan at 80%, lock core clock on 1650 and memory clock on 1450. I'm getting good temperatures this way and I also find, found that LHR autotune step size 0 0.2 works for me. So fan and 80%, 1650 for locked core clock and 1450 for memory clock. Thanks for watching and please subscribe.